Hello. Hi guys. Welcome you all to the DevOps Delight YouTube channel. In today's video, we are going to see yet another challenging tasks of Code Cloud Engineer. So first of all, let me go to Code Cloud Engineer website. Let me type engineer.codecloud.com slash practice hit enter. So let me click on curriculum. From today onwards, we are going to do the 100 days of DevOps. So let me click on add to practice. Click on active practice. So let me click on start. So this is uh, one of the program newly launched by the Code Cloud team. So here in this, they are going to unlock each day one task for 100 days for free of cost if in case if you have pro subscription then you can able to unlock or i mean to say you can do multiple tasks in a single day if you don't have subscription then you need to do only one task per day yeah that's what so for now let's start the day one so day one we are going to do the linux user setup with non-interactive shell task let me click on the start button it may take one or two minutes to load our task. Meanwhile, I'm skipping the video here for a while. Okay, we got our task. First, let me read the task. Then we will look into the solution. To accommodate the backup agent tool specifications, the system admin team at Xvision Corp Industries requests the creation of a user with non-interactive shell. Here is your task. Create a user named Kareem with a non-interactive shell on App Server 1. So now we need to log into App Server 1 and within App Server 1 we need to create a user named Kareem with non-interactive shell. So to get App Server 1 details let me click on this wiki page this icon. Let me come down and this is the App Server 1 details. Tony is a username and server name is stapp01. So in order, by default, we are in the jump host. In order to log in into the app server one, we need to use SSH and then username Tony at the rate server name ST app 01. Enter. And are you sure to connecting? Yes. So here we need to paste the password of so app server one of Tony user. This is the one. Let me copy it paste it here hit enter now we are inside the app server 1 let me change it to root user sudo su space iphone and again i need to give the password let me hit enter now i logged in into the st app 01 as a root user let me clear the oh. i'm trying to clear the screen but it is not allowing maybe so they did not give us access to clear the screen what we can do is first of all before creating user let me verify whether kareem user exists or not so for that we need to use the command cat slash etc pass wd grip kareem see i can't able to see anything which means Kareem user is not exist in this app server one. Now let me add Kareem user along with non-interactive shell. sudo user add. What is the username? Kareem. And then since they asked right. So non-interactive shell for that we need to give the iPhone iPhone shell. Yes bin slash no login. Hit enter. Now it is created. Let me validate once. See, now we can able to see user named Kareem is created and no login screen. Now let me click on check button to validate whether the task that we did is right or wrong. Click on confirm. Yes, it is right. Congratulations. We have successfully completed day one challenge of our 100 days of devops so each day one task to sharpen our devops skills 
okay that's it for this video guys see you tomorrow with day 2 task of 100 days of devops challenge thank you